Hello everyone, my name is Corazar, and welcome back to Sunless Sea, where we were just about to head out on a new exploration loop and also to head back to the Salt Lions. We got a recent lover here in London, so that's pretty good. And yeah, I think that's enough said. Let's get right to it. All right, let's roll. So we're going to go up this direction. Probably in a mostly straight line. I'm going to keep my eyes out on our periphery for any signs of light. Yeah, I think with our next Sphinx stone shipment, we should have enough to buy that 1500 engine power engine. Whose name I do not recall. Ah, Hunter's Keep. I forgot this was here. So this is a place you should probably visit regularly because you can get some pretty good stuff here. There are several sisters who live here. What does this say? Ah. So we have a choice. We can either keep the uh, keep the locket and we will have a permanent lover back in London or we can throw it away. Let's keep it. We now have a sweetheart in London. As the air is cold, but the heat of your blood has warmed the metal of the locket. Keep it close. Let's just pop in here. And dock. Hunter's Keep, what do we have here? So we can get a port report, of course. All right. We can spy on the house. You know, it's a veil challenge? Sure, why not? You peer through a half-open French window into a grand parlor, grand in size if a little reduced in style by dust and neglect. A dark-haired, pale-skinned young woman bends earnestly over a piano keyboard. Another, fair-haired but unmistakably her sister, sprawls on the sofa with a book. A third sits by the fireplace, staring sorrowfully into the embers. Soon, she says, and the piano music falters and stops. You'll go hungry and then the end will come for me, but not for you. The pianist raises her eyes from the keyboard. Hush, if we don't speak of it, she frowns. Has she seen you at the window? You withdraw. Let's present yourself at the house. Knock and enter. A maid with a smoldering topaz eyes shows you into the parlor where three young women wait. A visitor of the youngest cries, the next youngest chuckles, the eldest sighs. Do excuse the indecorum, she says. Visitors are rare. You are very welcome. I am Cynthia. The noisy one is Phoebe. The cheerful one is Lucy. You are in good time for lunch. Will you join us? Distant bells. Okay. Ah, okay. What do we have here? Ah, we would need something that awaits you. Okay. Let's do lunch with Cynthia. Melancholy. Wow. Cynthia grasps your arm and whispers to you. Her eyes are wide and blue. Her hair is wild and tangled. Bats might nest in it. It seems to you that you are sitting on a hillside above a wide blue lake, listening to a story of a murder, an axe, a net, blood on scented water. Another chop, Cynthia asks. You barely touched your food. Here, I'll have the maid wrap something up for you. You can't be hungry. It's not safe to be hungry. So we gained one terror. We gained one tail of terror. We gained one supply. We are now acquainted with them. We lost twelve hunger. It looks like we might be able to gain iron if we had low iron. And we have the gods of the sea of the Z salt attention trait. This is something that you can spend for certain things in certain story features. Now we could. Try to bring them back out, but I don't think we need to. Let's go ahead and launch. Up, up, and away. All right, heading northeast. In our slow ship away from the bats. No, bats go, oh, go away. No one loves you, bats. Uh, they know where, uh, no, they know where we are. Three 
the three exclamation points shows that they are know where we are and they're attacking. Ow. Knock it off. Boom. Alright. Reduce terror or eat? No. Uh, terror. Goodbye. Go ahead and fire it up again. We're back on our way. Enter the snares. Don't want to be here. Now, something we can do is we have a Z bat, which will go out and it'll tell us something we might see within range. Okay. No islands within Z bat's range. Now, here, I mentioned, I think, in the first episode, you'll see these lines here. These denote the different zones of the world, the map. And so you can sort of tell what zone you're in, and within each zone, we'll determine sort of what spawns there. So this area in another place that I was in recently-ish was actually south of London by a pretty good distance. So we're getting a different mix of things than I had last played, and every time you play this, this will randomize. There are certain things you can do to n sort of unrandomize them, but they're not really recommended. Z-Bat, let's go. No islands within range, okay. What have we here? Ding! Oh, here we go. We can put the port here. This is Stoddard's Haven in Frost Found. Okay. Towers and ramps and galleries and stairs of ice raised and spun like an Artex honey dream. We can engage an officer. Okay, cool. We can get a new officer here. He's a mechanic. Oh, okay. Yeah. The tireless mechanic has had enough of Frostfound. He smiles at you over his spectacles, teeth chattering. Brr, so glad to see a ship at last. Ready to offer my services. I'm an engineer. Finest shall ever hire. Treat engines like my own children. Not that I have children. Too busy. Usually busy. Okay. So tea with the squatters. Ask about, ask about the castle. Enter Frostfound. We need to hire mirrors and get a report report. Okay, report report, done. Let's get the mechanic. Why not? And let's see, let's do tea with the squatters. Supplies and fuel and lost hair. Not too shabby. Some of them wear the robes of Iremi Riddlefishers. Some look like Withern folk, but even more ragged. But they do seem a little more practical than either of those peoples. We're keeping the steps for the game with truths, a helpful Riddle Fisher explains, as she fills her cup for the third time. Every year the people of Irem and Wither meet here for, she pauses, contests, she finished vaguely. The difference between a question and a riddle. One day someone will prove themselves enough to enter the castle. You spend a pleasant few hours while the tea is supplemented with Iremi liquors, pale Wither and beer, and something the Riddle Fisher describes Billy as snake cake. They offer you fuel and supplies before you leave. We keep enough to spare, the Riddle Fisher grins. From time to time, a captain gets lost and comes up here, and we always feel bad for them. All right, not too bad. No shops. Okay. Let's take a look at the map here. We are pretty far northeast. But you know what? Let's keep going. Oops. have my dock button next to the go button. All right. Let's check out what's north of here first and see if there's anything along the northern continent area here. We can go under this bridge here without crashing, I hope. Ooh, 
These guys, huh? Let's see. You know what? Yeah, let's just try to sneak underneath him. These guys are, they're not super tough, but for our ship, they are super tough. Let's put it that way. Oh, no. Don't turn this way. Keep going. All right, so I think we should find Mount Palmerston probably in this direction over here. Zbat, do your thing. Right is southwest. Go ahead and mark that. Oh, no. No. Leave me alone. Oh, you're slow. Good. Excellent. You'd love to see it. Let's see. It said marker on the map. I don't see it. Oh, it's just sort of added it to something here? Is it going to open up the part of the map, maybe? I'm not sure. Thornwell Croft. The Shepherd Isles. Oh my. Yeah, pirate ships. We can go ahead and stop here. Sheep, lichen, standing stones. Of course, the bearded watchman tells you. There are no actual shepherds on the Shepherd Isles. So we can, let's see, port report. Let's do it. Oh, we can get a navigator for 50 echoes. The Citadel Red Navigator. I, let me guide your ship. I know all the Z, how it was, how it will be. Please, the headaches only stop when I am working. Sure, we'll take a first officer. Please and thank you. Let's see. Let's do you for my engineer, and we'll do you for first officer. Excellent. Oops. So I'm going to close that. So we have something awaits you. Picnic at the Standing Stones. We don't really need to reduce our terror. We do tales of stones, graves, or the croft. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's see. Graves. Why not? Hunters at rest. The Chelinet. Right. They're hunters. They killed a turtle the size of London and built this city on its shell. A ship from the Chelinet came by, hunting the Midnight Whale. Three of them had died cowards, so their bodies couldn't go into the Z. They paid us for land and whale ivory. I still got a piece, but it keeps it safe. We got a Z story, a memory of distant shores, and we expended our something awaits you. Not much else to do here. We can buy expensive fuel. No, thank you. Well, let's launch. We probably do need to turn south and go to the Salt Lions to get back to London without uh, running out of fuel. So let's go ahead and do that. And Mount Palmerston's going to have to wait because I think it might be... You know what? Let's just go ahead and try one more, one more zone out. could be in here, though. I don't think it is, but it could be in there. Well, let's see what we can find out this way. Oop. We find a ship is what we find. Well, let's try to get past him. Oop, they're going to hit us that time. Looking a little bit rough here. 
No, I want to try to get kind of behind him if I can. There we go. Much better. Loot and scuttle. We get a crate of curiosities. We got five supplies. Not too bad. All right. So we will want to repair next time we get back to London. But what do we have here? We have a lily pad with frogs. Zebat, do your thing. What do you got for me? No islands. Oh, there's a ship up there too. Sorry, ship. Not interested right now. Interesting. I do usually find Mount Palmerston kind of up in this direction. What are you? Okay, you're a island. <laughs> See if there's anything up here. Z bat. Underwater to the east. Alright, not sure I can get underwater yet. The Z bat's range isn't terribly huge, so. We have to kind of spam it northwest. Ah, there we go. Okay. You got to be careful because there is a big monster that can spawn here. So, watch out. All right, Mount Palmerston. All right, what do we have here? Any shops we can buy fuel from? Ooh, we have cheap fuel here. Nice. There we go. Now our hold, let's see, we need to bring this where? Where's my journal? Here we go. Uh, how do we use this here? Objectives, Tomb Colonists, Ventures, Misk. I think we have to bring this here, but it might have been somewhere else. Let's see, favors. Ah, here we go. I think this might be it. Yes, we are here. Okay, good. Let's visit the mount. Let's see. Deliver your smuggled souls. All right, let's do it. And we'll get paid in London. Okay, that's fine. I'm cool with that. I love the music here. Let's hold off on exploring just yet. We could get another officer if we had some parabola linen. Get a port report, sure. What do we have here? Dig among the ruins. Sure, why not? We lost two supplies, we got two zoop, one memory of distant shores, and five terror. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Let's see, if I go to the crater, what happens up the road? Now, let's go ahead and do the explore the island. The Z opens out beneath a high cliff. The high place. The Z like a rippled sheet of night green jade. The roof of the neath above, bellied with stocklights and pricked with false star. Look out across the water. What are you thinking of? Your sweetheart. An ocean of darkness lies between you and your sweetheart. But you remember them still. Let's strengthen that relationship. Yeah. Light, laughter, warmth. Remember a little while, and then go on with your voyaging. Okay, so... 
We can keep digging in the ruins if we want to. But I think we are going to... Ah, we can't go up the uh, mountain anymore. Okay, that's fine. In which case, let's see, we were here to buy devil bone dice. We need seven of those, but I think we have a zoop. I don't really think I care about zoop, do I? We can sell it for zero. <laughs> okay, thanks, guys. All right. So, let's check our hold. I wish there was a number here without having to click this jettison button. So, 24 out of 40. Okay. We're going to end up with 31. Let's, let's buy the dice, and we will just ditch some things when we get to the salt lions. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. And let's head out. Yeah, we'll just toss some fuel and supplies overboard if we don't burn through it by the time we get there. Uh, we might. We might burn through it. So uh, let's get on our way to the salt lions. Although I think we're going to wrap up the episode probably pretty soon. So let's see if we can get there quickly and do our delivery and get back to London. It's a quiet journey. Ooh. Don't want to tangle with them either. All the way here is the quiet drip drip of water pouring in from the ceiling or dripping in occasionally. What's this? This is more lily pad. I do love the atmosphere of this game. Hey, we got something. Discovered Nupmit Harbor. Okay. I think I know where we are. Do you think we're... Well, we can stop here. Well, if we do, we have to spin around this way. I don't recall this place being, like, super happening last time I played this game. Let's go ahead and... Dock. Ah, it's a prison place. Okay. A prison for the Conate. Hand over a prisoner. Exchange a secret prisoner. And compile a port report. Okay. We could rescue a prisoner and get a crew member. <laughs> Sheesh. Go to the port report and call it a day. The frog is sitting there croaking, little throat puffing out. All right, salt lions, here we come. Ooh, deadly shark coming for us. Let's stay out of range of him. I have bad memories of splintering decks and crew overboard and those things. At this stage of the game, stealth is our, our friend for those sharks and most of the bigger creatures. Fed the crew. Yep. Letting us know that our food is ticking down. What is this? Let's take a quick peek while we're here. Oh, uh, there is a something there. I think it's a lighthouse, though. I'm pretty sure. Discovered Skyler's End. Okay. Yep, it's the big lighthouse. Okay. Cool. We are very close to salt lines, though, so we're going to continue on our way. 
And yeah, I am just making sure that I get a glimpse of everything so that we can get our fragments to get our secrets to get our stats. Now if you see these large abysses scattered here and there, those are places where if you have a submarine, you can descend. Eh. Didn't want to deal with this guy, but okay. Let's go ahead and... It was a 50 hit points. Beat it, buddy. Get out of here. I don't want to see you. No, thank you. These guys are pretty easy to dodge as long as you just keep turning. They usually can't hit you. And one more shot should take him out. Whoop. No thanks. I will pass on that. Boom. There we go. Let's uh, take a peek here. We kind of scoop it up or let it disperse. Uh, I don't want to eat it. We don't need the food anyway. Let's watch the colors fade. We gained a Z story. Not too bad. I think sometimes you can either lose terror or gain a Z story, and I think it's worth it, unless you're really starving. But we're trying to dump our supplies and fuel <laughs> so we can pick up some Sphinx Stone. All right. Hello, Salt Lions. Let's get our port report. There we go. Let's see. We do have, let's see, salt rights. Ooh, interesting. We're not defiant. We have salt's attention. The face of the northern sphinx is all but lost. Lo or gone. Lost faces are scared, sacred to salt, they say. You are drawn there. To what end? Salt's voice is distant but clear. You know what? Sure, let's do it. What do we get? Ooh, cool. We have seven terror. All right, it's not so good. We gained one extraordinary implication. Okay. That's pretty handy, actually. Let's see. So, we need 200 echo. We have that. Let's check our hold. We need to dump three things. Goodbye, Zoop. And probably goodbye, one fuel. Let's do it. If the stones weep and Unmaker advises you, ignore them. Unless they flood your hold, of course. Then you should probably drop them overboard. Don't tell anyone who said that. Okay. Off we go. And we're heading pretty well straight back to London here. Where we will dump off our Sphinx Stone and call it a day. But first, I don't think we have a port report from here. Ah, uh, right, this is the one where we have to... Hmm, you know, let's try it. We failed. We lost a crew, gained five terror, okay. You and one of your more villainous-looking sailors join a dice game. Villainous-looking, but you know for a fact that she tithes to charity and has a delightful singing voice. <laughs> The topic turns promisingly to pillage and ambush, but your zailer is a little too forward with their questions. There's a scuffle and a stabbing. You escape. She does not. Okay, so we gain terror, lose crew, and gain port report. That probably wasn't worth it. Let's see. Let's explore the morn. Ah. Oh, you know what? Let's do it. We have two of each of these. <laughs> the same guy. No, Uno Reverse, I have stories for you. That was it. Okay. That wasn't really worth the exchange, honestly. Fresh from the sea, he has experienced horror and wonder. But so have you, and your tale is so much the fresher. You wrestle with each other's histories until at last he concedes. Here, he says, 
This is where it all began, with the astronomer, the ephemerides. He whispers in your ear. Did we get something? I don't think we did. Just a secret from the fragments, okay. Well, that's that for there, and back to London we go. All right, folks, we are arriving back in fallen London. It is a main ad ship. Nice. Let's go ahead and dock. Let's collect our message from the Harbor Master. We have someone wanting to sign on. Let's see. Let's do Souls Delivered. What a propitious and encouraging occasion this is to meet again here in this place which has been so very fortunate for us both. Allow me to shake you warmly by the hand since you've demonstrated your unswerving commitment to fair dealing and honest conveyage. Very good. My patron will toast to you. We'll take payment. Ooh, 200 echo. Ooh, uh, hmm. Should have stopped and delivered the uh, Sphinx Stone first. Let's do that for now. Although those are more expensive, so fuel goes overboard. Okay. Here is your compensation and a little fuel and a few barrels of biscuits, but a certain other captain has widely surrendered for the common good. I will take the good word to my patron, and if I am a man of my word, we will see each other again. Unless a whale eats you, of course, in which case I hope you will not think poorly of me for wishing that we will not. Okay. What does he want? Once more, we find ourselves here on the K side, which is, I suppose, you might say, the lip of the well of opportunities. Let us both drink deeply from this well, by which I mean, my patron has a task for you. Take a payment across the ocean and bring back a little package. Sure. Of course, if you return to London without the little, the little package, I'll probably have something sharp to say about it. Well, wow. okay. So I assume that we have to, ah, okay. We have to bring back an unstamped crate of brilliant souls before completing the task. We probably have to buy it, so we can't spend these echoes yet. Do not, <laughs> do not do that, it is bad. Okay. Let's do our port reports. Gators more, oh, darn it. I'll tell you what, let's go and actually deliver our Sphinx Stone, finally. There we go. 500 Echoes. Lost to Terror. Alright. Now we can go and talk to the Admiral. Hunter's Keep. Oh, Palmerston. That one's worth 40 Echoes for the distance. Shepherd Isles, submit as fact. We'll do hearsay. Frost found. Not too bad. Wisdom. Bird, the oracles look hungry. Salt lines, once again. And we don't have that second strategic information, so we can't turn it into vital intelligence. So we're going to just hang on to it for now. Now, where did he want us to go? Uh, he said... It was, I think it's Carnelian, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Well, everyone, we're going to leave it at that. I'm going to do a little bit of shopping, making sure we still have a thousand echoes in the bank. Before we do anything silly. Oh, you know what? Before we end here, let's go to here. We'll give this guy something perilous. Go. 500 Echo, not too bad. All right. When I was a boy, I asked my nurse, when you break a law, what happens to the pieces? Now I know. Now I know. 
But I need something else. Okay. That's either meter salt or more del bone dice. Okay. That's pretty easy. 700 echoes. Ooh. Not too bad. That might be what we do. All right. So now we're going to call it there for the episode. Hope you all enjoyed the exploration and the creepy places that we discovered down here. Let me know what you think in the comments. And as always, my name has been Corazar. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.